Right, and in the Arab world, Mohammed, how much hope was there in Trump? There was a lot. And let me, uh, listen, I, I, I covered the Palestinian Authority uh, intensely, and I think there was this uh, uh, optimism that I, they think they didn't feel it in previous administrations, and they actually put all their eggs in one basket. Unfortunately for the Palestinian Authority, it did not pay off. President Abbas was very optimistic. He felt that President Trump could be the one that will shake things up, that he will come in as a businessman, will try to maybe do things uh, in a different way that uh, maybe other presidents and previous administrations didn't uh, use or do in the past. That did not work mm. to the Palestinian Authority and Palestinian officials' uh, uh, liking. And in fact, President Abbas feels uh, betrayed by President Trump. And it was a shock, complete shock, for the Palestinian Authority and the Arab world that mm. uh, President Trump made the announcement uh, on Jerusalem that he made.